Ronan O'Neill, you did a very good impression of Mickey Hart there tonight. <laughs> I don't know about that now, I think. Uh, I was happy enough at the start of the year, the boys asked me to take the, the Brock Cup team, you know, and the boys have uh, played fantastic well all year, and I was lucky enough, you know, the, the men who was over them in the first or second year, you know, I've drilled them well, and I've just added my wee bits and pieces to them, you know, I've learned over with, with Throne and underage as well, so, no, great bunch of lads, happy to be involved, you know, and happy we got, happy we got the trophy at the end of it. And what did you learn from the other coaches in the school, which shall we say, the more experienced teachers? Well, you know, just take each game as it comes, you know, and... Uh, not to get too, too involved with you know, just relax a little, you know, and I suppose you see different things standing from the sideline as, as you wouldn't as a player, and uh, it's diff- I enjoy the coaching, you know, I do, I do it uh, all the time during the summer and stuff, and uh, it's happy enough that I was able to manage, manage the team to a victory uh, at this time. At the final whistle, you needed all your speed to get out of the way when they came at you with the water? Aye, uh, well, Benny Gallon's been doing that all year, so, uh, so uh, you know, uh, as I said before, there, there's some some crack to all these boys, you know, and uh, train them all year has been in first class, you know, and uh, I'm happy enough, you know, to be involved with, with the team. Your manager is a certain Tyrone player, Ronnie O'Neill. What was he like to be playing under this year? Uh, he's, he's great to have in the change room now. Like he, he brings a different style of play he's this year, so he has. And really, it's, that's been the difference in us beating teams and not like our style of play and different tactics he's brought to the game. Tell me about your manager, Ronnie O'Neill. How did he do this year? <laughs> Aye, uh, he's a superstar. <laughs> Look, <laughs> well, the throne, he's bringing on all the experience of the throne, and it's great to have him in this year. I think the school need to keep him. <laughs> There's obviously a lot of quality coming through in almost CBS. Ah, uh, it's just deadly, you know, when we played this year, one of our best players hurt or, or broke his leg, you know, and it's just even we showed that we could still win without him, you know, and it just shows the quality we have in this good. Why do you think there is that quality coming through so much in almost CBS? Just because the. Uh, Coaches we have like Ronnie O'Neill, Miss McBride, Mr. Donnelly, and all you know, they just bred football you now and they just know how to they bred one Indy. Like you mentioned, Ronnie O'Neill, there he took over as manager. How did he do? Ah, oh, mighty, you know, it's great to have him in. Obviously, he's been after school, he knows everything about it, like, and he just knows to drill us, he knows to drill what to drill into us and just how to get us out as winners. You've only been in the school a year, the school, but the school's been doing well for a few years. What do you think they're doing right there that it's bringing through such a lot of talent? I think me coming into school this year. <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, the coaches and the, the CBS are fantastic. You know, they're really RJ oriented. You know, and uh, they put a lot of time and effort. And I can, I've just seen, you know, t- taking a team puts a lot of time and effort. And you know, and, uh, it's a bit tiring at times. You know, but uh, in days like this year, you really enjoy it, really, So happy enough.